The Fermi Paradox Solution number one They are already here So this solution is the most obvious one People see UFOs all the time Obviously the aliens are already here the difficulty with this scenario is that, by definition, a UFO is an unidentified flying object. Once a UFO is identified, it becomes an IFO, an identified flying object. So if I see a light in the sky and I don't know what it is, until I hear the roar of aircraft engines, it's unidentified. Once I hear the roar of the aircraft engines and my brain says, ah, that sounds like an airplane, now I've identified it. Well, there's an issue with the understanding of UFO. It has become synonymous with flying saucer, which is implied to be some kind of aircraft beyond our capability, human capabilities. And by default, the thought is that it is aircraft operated by alien beings or sent by alien beings. So there's confusion between UFO and alien piloted aircraft. So the problem is that we really have no evidence to the effect that UFOs are extraterrestrial piloted craft. There's just no evidence to that effect. Some people believe that the Roswell incident uh, was a crash landing of a craft that was piloted by aliens, but we have no evidence to that effect. No scientific evidence. And belief is great, and people can believe whatever they want to believe. In an absence of fact, they can make statements and believe what they want. Um, my own personal thought is, show me. Show me the evidence. Don't show me a badly filmed so-called autopsy of uh, a creature where the visual effects are no better than a cheaply made horror movie. And then turns out to be a hoax, which was... Uh, which the hoaxers made a great deal of money off of. Show me physical evidence. Show me an alloy that cannot be created on Earth. Show me an advanced guidance system from the wreckage that uh, none of us have ever thought of. Show me something like that. So until there's evidence to that effect, um, I'm going to believe that lights in the sky are lights in the sky. And there's a lot of phenomena in the sky that we just don't understand, uh, even to this day. Uh, different types of lightning, um, ball lightning in particular. Uh, but there's all kinds of uh, atmospheric phenomena that we're still unsure about. And I think that, uh, you know, although not every single incident can be explained this way, uh, a lot can. I know there's strange stuff going on right now with um, the uh, so-called sightings that the uh, Navy uh, has footage of, but uh, those are not explained as of this date. And uh, I'm very interested to see what the explanation is if we ever get one. But for right now, there's no solid evidence of alien piloted craft. So that's the where I weigh in on that. But where do you weigh in on that? You are certainly entitled to your opinion. You can put it below in the comments. And uh, yeah, smash like if you like this kind of content. And if you want me to continue. And I will. I probably will anyway. But I'd like to hear what you have to say about it, of course. And subscribe if you want to hear more. So hope you have a great night. And uh, keep looking up. Never know what you might see. Take care.